everyone welcome back to moments like this i'm toya Kolly and i'm here with my wonderful husband once again hi everybody we really hope you're doing well you're keeping safe and you're getting ready for reopenings everywhere mm -hmm. we want to say a big thank you for sharing our videos and for following us on all our social media angles we're grateful for all the comments keep sharing keep liking and keep sending those comments in thank you once again Today we want to talk about optimizing opportunities. Yeah. You know, whenever there's a situation like this, opportunities are always out there. They are bound. Mm. And so we wanted to know that if you've not been looking at them, it's also good to look at them. Yeah. Because these opportunities are for us to be able to enjoy and for us to be able to take advantage of. So let me just talk about the opportunities the government of this particular wonderful country, the United States of America, has given to all small business owners out there. SBA, as we call it, Small Business Administration, has several packages for small businesses so that you can take advantage of it. And why they are doing this is because they do not want people to, I mean, go bankrupt or even pack up their businesses. And so there are opportunities for programs like Small Business Disaster Loan, which is forgivable. There's also opportunity for PPP, we call it PPP, it's called a, a Paycheck Protection Program. And so many people have been saying, oh, I didn't get that one. You, you, if you have submitted your application, it's good to be patient. Yeah. And if even that doesn't come true, there are still so many things you can do as we'll hear from Pastor Dele. But I want to say it's good for us to check out the SBA page because if you do not get one, there are other ones like the retention program, like the, you know, the leave and other stuff. So if you do not get one, you can get other ones. It is just to help your business even at this time. So let me allow my wonderful husband to chip in a bit into... Yes, this just to support what Pastor is saying. We even heard in the news that even there's some packages there in the works. Yes. So we don't want you to despair, you know, even if you don't get the PPE or the SBA loan now, just be patient and then watch out for opportunities again. And even after, even at that, you can still look outside of such programs Yes. around your businesses, around your ventures or your outfit. I mean, there's some things that others are doing that you can copy. Yeah. You can emulate what they're doing or you can improve up on it. Yes. And also, maybe probably there's some things they're not doing. Then you can take the opportunity and begin to do those things they're not doing in their businesses. Uh, how about salary earners, Pastor Tony? Even salary earners, the government has several um, opportunities out there for you. Yes. I mean, you remember the stimulus package? Mm -hmm. I believe the phase two of it is still it's going to still come. Going, yeah. So if you've not gotten the stimulus package, it is still going to come. Yes. And also, if you are a salary earner, you can talk to your bank and let them ask them what you can apply for. The government has several out there. There are people that are on employment right now. And uh, even though we've heard that it's, it's been a bit um, tricky because the, the, the amount, the volume of people to attend to yes. is quite large because of the coronavirus, but they are still attending to people. And... Um, you know, you talk to your employer, talk to your bank. There are so many of them. If we begin to list them right now, mm -hmm. we won't be able to finish them. And I believe that this is also a time for, for churches yeah. to make good use of this opportunity of being online at this time. Yes. You know, it is very important for us to know that there are some people that would not want to leave their homes to go to church. Mm -hmm. But we can minister to them even through the internet, so make sure you invite people to church, even online, and make sure you reach out to people because this time you can reach out to even more than your physical congregation member. Yeah, exactly. You can reach out to hundreds and thousands and millions of people. Yes. And what more will make God happy than us reaching the world with his words? Because a lot of people right now are looking for the word of God. Uh -huh. Some are in desperate, some are really confused, some are depressed, and they need the word of God so that their minds can be in the right place once again. Yes. Also, to salary earners, you know, some of us who have some certificates, some degrees that we're not using right now, maybe this is the best time to dust those certificates yes. and let them know in your place of work, who knows, that can be a promotion for you. 
because I can assure you there's some companies that will want to downsize, some want to change their departments, so they want to change their strategy, but probably you have a degree you not, you've not been yes. using in your place of work. This is an opportunity for you to bring it out and say, hey, I can double as this in the place of work. And then let me also talk about those who have no, who don't have a job. You know, mm. I mean, it looks like it's a tough time to get a job, but listen to me. It's also an opportunity. Tough times also bring opportunities. It does. Yeah, don't it does. stop looking for job. Mm -hmm. Don't stop applying. Mm -hmm. Send your res resume out mm -hmm. there. You'll be surprised that this opportunity can create. I mean, this time, I'm sorry, can create opportunities that will meet your own skill. Yes. And probably you are, you've been aspiring to start a business. This is a good time. Yes. Because people are looking for comfort. They're looking for safety. And you can play a part in this. You can make a difference by supplying their need, by meeting their needs. And God will bless you in the name of our Lord Jesus. We want to say thank you for joining us for a moment like this, this time around. We are so glad that you've been following us. We're so glad that you've been also listening to our tidbits. We promise you we'll always bring things that will always help you and be of profit to you in the mighty name of Jesus. Help us to like our page. Help us to uh, subscribe to our channel and keep inviting people to moments yes, like this. Yes. God bless you and may the Lord be with you in Jesus' name. Thank you so much once again. From me, it's bye-bye until next time. Bye.